Yo, 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 what's up, guys? Your boy here, Mike, here in Nix TV. Uh, good morning, sa kapwa ko, small YouTubers. Especially for this video, we'll be talking about making money out of Google AdSense. Alright? But before we proceed with this video, please don't forget to like, share, and hit that subscribe button and click that notification bell so that you won't miss any videos from Minx TV. Alright, so I did mention uh, to all my fellow small YouTubers like me, yung mga nagsisimula pa lang, uh, kakamanitized pa lang, kakakuha pa lang ng 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours. Congratulations to you and to us. And the moment we start earning those small cents, small dollars, we are already excited to, you know, get paid. But before we actually get even paid, uh, Google AdSense has to do something and you have to do something for them to verify your address. This is what they call the Google AdSense spin. Alright, so I think a few months after I was monetized, uh, I received an email. Okay, listen carefully guys. Uh, by the way, the reason why I'm doing this uh, uh, video is for us for those who already got their emails from Google Adsense and is yet to get their pin in their mailbox because Google Adsense will send the pin through snail mail low tech right for a big company snail mail pero parang this is just to make sure that you put in the correct address together with the name Say yung Google AdSense uh, payment details, payment account, or payment name and information. Paano natin gagawin yun? So, in my case, I got the email like several months ago. And of course, I acted upon on it. And then, sinunod ko yung steps. Uh, sabi nila dun sa email is, uh, you will get it within 3 weeks in the mail. Alright? So, nakantay ako. This video will be covering what we can do to avoid the wait kasi nga um, while we wait and while we don't get the pin uh, there are chances that your videos or your channel will not be monetized or ads will not be showing up ayaw natin yun kasi the whole reason why we're doing this is partly to earn from the ads right so without further ado let's get down to it so this video will be talking about um how to get your pin in less than a minute Whoa. correct you heard that right it's less than a minute and i was surprised as well that there is actually a way to get that done all right but first of all for us small youtubers still wait for a few more months and then you'll get an email that's the first step you will get an email from google adsense uh, saying that they've sent you a pin that will arrive in your mailbox three to four weeks Alright, so the intention, the idea there is for you to um, wait. Um, they will also ask you to verify, uh, make sure that you put in the correct address and the name in your payments address in Google AdSense. So it will show, I will show you some details of the email here. Uh, that it was, it will also allow you to click a link so that in order for you to change the address. Alright. And then below that, you will also receive a verify address. That is only useful when you actually got the physical pin from your mail. But since this is your first email, you have to wait for a couple of weeks. So that's the first step. The second step is you have to verify, make sure that your address is correct. Everything, your name and then your address, put in your phone number just to make sure and then your email. So in order for you to do that, you have to log into your Google AdSense account. Most likely that will be your YouTube channel account and the email that you have attached to that regist registered account. So once you're already in Google AdSense, go to the payment menu and then you would see three tabs there. You see uh, uh, four tabs, basically your earnings, transactions, how you get paid, and then settings. You have to focus on the settings and then you click on manage settings that's where you're gonna see your details 
focus on the name and information make sure that the address are correct all right that's important because if they're gonna send you a mail and then it goes somewhere else because of the address is wrong that's not Google AdSense fault it's basically your fault oh no correct? I know I know medyo napaka low tech diba uh, we have um, paperless 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 payment we have online payment we have fund transfer we have electronic fund transfer that's the same thing we have PayPal we have all this kind of stuff. I don't know why Google AdSense cannot use that. Just to pay you off through all those other mode of payments without, you know, uh, validating your address. But anyways, we still have to comply because this is their way of validating you. Whether you're a legit uh, content creator or not. Nakalipas na ilang buwan. Wala pa rin yung mail mo. So, Na, no? So you go back to Google AdSense page and then there's a, uh, there's a tab there that says your uh, verify address. So when you click that, you have an option to resend the pin. Alright, so just keep resending the pin. So that is in hope that it will expedite the pin. Of course, when you resend, it's another three weeks. So. And then Google will tell you, um, even though you've re requested for a recent PIN, kung dumating man yung naunang request mo or yung pinadala nila sa'yo, that is still valid. You can still use that. Just recent, no? So once you did that, I think uh, uh, it's just normal for us to, you know, wait and then once you didn't get it, follow up, di ba? Parang ganun. So, that's one way of following it up. You, you request for a reset of the pin. And that's what I did. I think I did it like four times or five times. Kasi ang tagal. So before we go to the, to, to actually go into the steps of getting your pin in less than a minute, there are things that you need to, to prepare. All right. So first one, of course, you have to be logged into your Google AdSense account. Make sure that you remember your login and your password. Second, open your email or your your email that is registered to your Google AdSense because para makita mo rin yung mga notification na mangyayari once we, once we do this uh, pin, veri pin verification with Google AdSense Third, make sure you have a valid ID SSS, anything that has your name and the address attached to it and it has to be valid it has to be a government ID SSS, yun nga, TIN number, whatever or Proof of billing, uh, a receipt, insurance, car insurance, house insurance, house payment, uh, anything that has your name and has the address in it. And make sure that the address is the same one that's configured in your Google AdSense payment information. Alright, otherwise don't use that. Okay, and these are all should be dig digitally captured. So use your phone, take a picture and then make sure that it's really clear and readable. Okay, that's important. And then of course, get a glass of coffee or water and then sit back, relax, and I'll tell you how to get that pin in less than a minute. All right, so we're in step number three. So the, go back to the email that you got from Google, Google AdSense, and then below the verify address, the yellow box that you see there, you will see two links. It says below, need help. There's one link, learn more about address pin verification. Second is, Pin Troubleshooter, that's where we're going to be looking at. You go and click that Pin Troubleshooter. Alright, so once you're inside Pin Troubleshooter, there will be a couple of questions. In fact, there are three questions there. Uh, let's go through each question. Huh? So the first question is, check that your earnings are greater than $10 or the local equivalent. To view your earnings, you just follow the steps. Alright, so you saw that in your Google AdSense, the first page. The first four, four, pack, four tabs under the payment uh, menu. And uh, yes, of course, you would get, uh, as long as it's more than $10, you should get the PIN. You should be sent an email that uh, you're being requested to validate or verify your address. All right. Otherwise, it's already a no. And then, stop not I done. Okay. So, but if you are having more than ten dollars in your account proceed so you have to click yes 
All right. Second question, have you received your pin? Of course, no. The reason why we're doing pin troubleshooting is because we haven't received um, our pin. So you have to say no, all right? So, um, obvious, uh, napaka obvious naman tong step na to eh. So ang sagot dito is always no, all right? Third one, uh, have you received, have you already requested three replacement pins? Uh, I did mention I requested four times, re requested four times. So make sure you've requested three times um, before you can actually request for an expedite of your pin. So I did four times. So I said I would click yes. All right. So first question, yes. Second question, of course, I haven't received my pin. No. Third question, requested three replacement pins and yes. So then after that, this is where you are supposed to fill in the information and provide that digitally captured ID. All right, so put your name. Of course, your email address will be there. That's already a confirmed email. I mean, that's already your registered email. All right, uh, automatically populated for you unless it's a different email, then you have to put it there, but I doubt that, all right? And then AdSense Publishers ID. So where do I find that? All right. So if you go back to Google AdSense, um, yeah, you would see the publisher ID, and it has a word pub dash, and then your ID. Just copy that, and then paste it on the, your AdSense Publisher ID field. All right. And then choose files. So remember, I told you to prepare IDs, uh, government ID or any type of receipt and make sure that you copy them or you take a picture from your phone and then and then upload it to your computer so that you can upload it to them so make sure it's clear readable it has your name it has a complete address those information should be the same as the one that's configured in your google adsense payment information otherwise i don't think this will work all right, so that's a no-brainer, all right? And then click Submit. And then that's it. Bonk. So I did ask you to prepare and make sure that you're logged into your email because the moment you click Submit, you will get an email notification from the AdSense support team as shown here, all right? Thank you for contacting the AdSense support team. A specialist is investigating your issue and reply as soon as possible. Blah, 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 blah. Kind regards, AdSense support team. All right. A few seconds after that particular email, you will get probably two emails from the same support team saying and confirming that your address is verified. And then they will tell you to validate it and check it through your ISS account all right although from the box you would see that your uh, the verify your address uh, box still says you need to verify you have to wait for 24 to 48 hours before you can actually see this wow this 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 but True enough, as long as you got the email from AdSense Support confirming that you are verified and validated, it's as good as you already have the PIN. All right, so basically once you get the email 24 hours, 48 hours after, just to make sure that everything is updated. But the fact that you got the email confirms that you already are verified. So how fast is that? So just make sure the bottom line is just to make sure that you request for a recent pin more than three times. At least three times. Right? I think that's the only way that they would, you know, entertain your request. Otherwise, I'm not sure. It might fail. Because mine, I tried it four times. Alright, so I hope that clarifies every question that you have in mind. And so, true enough, I got mine. And shout out to my wife. Because she's the one who told me that there are people doing this. And I checked it online and I did it immediately. Less than five minutes, I am verified. Wow. It works. And then for those of you who I mean are willing to wait 
Uh, well, there's nothing wrong with that. All right, so you can still just wait and wait for this. Wow. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's very ironic because the moment I did this one minute uh, pin troubleshooter, the following day, I got my Google AdSense mail. I haven't opened it though because I don't feel the need to open it anymore because I'm already verified. All right. So two ways that was uh, two things uh, that we have proven uh, here today in this video is that the pin troubleshooter works as long as you requested pins three times. It's less than a minute. You'll get a confirmation from AdSense support that you are verified, validated. And second, the snail mail actually works. All right. So those who are doubting whether the mail are gonna even gonna come at all, here's your proof. All right. So thanks Google AdSense and thanks to those guys who actually shared their thoughts on getting those pins within less than a minute. So I hope you guys are actually, I hope you guys enjoy this video and you've learned uh, a few things from me and then hopefully this, uh, this video helps you getting your pin uh, verified and validated so that you can continue on making content. People like us, small YouTubers, Earn a bit of money from Google AdSense moving forward and then improving our content, right? And actually, this gives me a boost and, uh, you know, excited now when I'm going to do content because I know I'm going to get paid. But it doesn't stop there though. So once you get verified, you have to uh, change your mode of payment. So this is how Google AdSense is gonna be paying you. So there's only two options available. I'm not sure if it's only in the Philippines. I don't know about the other countries, but in the Philippines, it's electronic fund transfer and checks. Of course, I don't wanna have checks. It's only EFT. So when I checked, it has to be in dollars account. All right, so you have to have a dollars account. You have to talk to your bank and get all the details of setting up your dollar accounts and and in the philippines in my bank i have to maintain 500 us dollar maintaining account in the in in my bank so that's the next one of course the third one is because the threshold is set to i think 100 before google adsense pays you then you have to wait for that all right and then it just continues on all right, so once you verified, once everything is set up, once you're validated, the next thing to do is change your mode of payment however you want it, checks or EFT, that's all up to you. Uh, I think both of them will, be, will have to have dollar accounts and then that's it, you're settled. And then you just continue doing contracts. All right, guys, so I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, it's morning for me, I'm having coffee and uh, I hope to see you guys on same similar videos so before i go please don't forget to like share and hit the subscribe button and click that notification bell so that you won't miss any videos from mix tv i hope you guys like this video and thank you very much and more power to us small youtubers all right i'll see you guys in a bit bye